Your ceiling fan looks like it's in slow motion. Great intro. Our stupid reactions. Tune in for the <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions. It's Corbin. Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. It's so juicy. Thank you for our Patreon. Follow our official Twitter account. Ring the bell to be brought with the note by Christian Scott. Bang! Today, we react into a trailer. What trailer do you ask, Rick? What trailer is exactly what I asked, Corbin? <gasps> well, let me tell you. It's for uh, Thackeray. Oh, okay. Yes, I've heard of this film. Have you? I have. Oh, good. Probably because stupid babies have been telling me about it. Uh, it's with a uh, new Ozzy and Sadaki. Have you ever heard of him? Rings a bell. Ozzy and Sadaki, did you say? Sadaki. Yeah, Sadaki. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't know him. The film follows uh, the life of Bala Shahab Thackeray, the founder of the Indian political party Shiv. Sheena. Cool. Uh, cool. Don't know who that is, but I'm guessing we'll learn. Uh, so hold on. Let me get it started here. You ready? Ready. Three, two, one, go. Oh. Mujhe Bombay shant chahiye. Is waqt Bombay ko ek hi aadmi shant kar sakta hai. Doesn't even look like him. Does he have a prosthetic nose on? Janata ka kaam karne ke liye janata ki beech jana padega. That's his voice. That's him. Get a different nose. What karni hogi? Going all fox catcher on us. Deshwajim Haras ka naam aur karne shuru. Arey bhik mangne se acha gunda ban ke apna hak chhinna. अभी ये सब यहाँ नहीं चलेगा पहला हक क्या के मराठी लोगों का है आप कहते हो कि महाराष्ट्र सिर्फ मराठी लोगों के लिए है मैं जब भी कहता हूँ कि जय हिंद जय महाराष्ट्र तो जय हिंद पहले कहता हूँ जय महाराष्ट्र बाद में क्योंकि मेरे लिए मेरा देश पहले है राज्य बाद में और आप ही के कहने पर आपके लोगों ने बाबरी मस्जिद को तोड़ दिया वहाँ पे तो राम मंदिर था आपको कैसे पता कि राम लल्ला वहीं पर पैदा हुए थे नहीं तो पाकिस्तान में पैदा हुए थे मैं सही हूँ या गलत इसका फैसला आपने देश की जनता करेगी क्योंकि सबसे ऊपर मैं एक ही अदालत को मानता हूं और वो है जनता की अदालत जो मेरे कंधे पे है ना वो तुम्हारा लोकतंत्र है मैं अगर अकेला भी रह गया ना तो लाखों लोगों को इकट्ठा करने की ताकत आज जगदम्बे ने मुझे दी है मुंबई में हुए दंगों में भी आपका हाथ था हाथ नहीं पाव था मेरा विचार बनकर लाखों लोगों के खून में बहेगा और उस खून के हर कतरे में ए बाल के शंभाकरी विंसर करानी जावेद में अंदर डाले दोनों मुल्कों में फिर से क्रिकेट मैचेस शुरू हो जाए तो हालात और भी सुधरेंगे आपका सिक्सर याद है मुझे एक्सेलेंट शॉट आपकी बैटिंग इतनी भी अच्छी नहीं थी कि मैं सीमा पर शहीद हुए जवानों के परिवारों का दुख दर्द भूल सकूं Dang. Oh, so that looks like intense. It also looks like I mean I'm I'm good. I will see anything Nawazuddin does. Anything yeah. he does, yeah. <laughs> it's definitely. I'm hoping it would be something that's accessible and like it allows people that know absolutely zero about this man and whatever movement right. this was to understand right. what's going on. Because 
Right. You know, anything they were talking about in there, I have zero idea Lost. what they were talking about. Me too. Uh, right. Exactly. Zero. That, and that makes sense because you know we're not from there, and I've never heard about any situation or him. Um, just like if somebody wasn't from America and didn't know about Watergate, if they talked about a bunch of stuff, they they're like, wait, what are you saying? He did who? Who did what? Uh, and so it's that similar type of thing. Not saying you guys don't know about Watergate. That's the thing I'm going with. Um, but I'm hoping this is that kind of film. And I have heard a lot of people recommend this film, so you guys can let us know how this film is. Yeah, and teaching the history of it, because it's obviously a true story. I'd love to see just a couple of things, a video of this man first, and get a feel for who he was before we watch Nawazuddin's uh, representation of him. But, I mean, right off the get-go, the first image they had of him, he was unrecognizable. It reminded me of how unrecognizable Steve Carell is in Foxcatcher. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I think he definitely had a prosthetic nose on. Mm-hmm, uh, yeah, definitely. Let's see, I didn't recognize anybody in the film. Uh, a controversial cartoonist to powerful Mumbai politician. Oh, he's a cartoonist first, interesting. Uh, mm. This biopic maps the uh, meteoric rise of the far-right Shiv Shishina party founder, Bala, ba Bal Thackeray. If I'm saying that right, I apologize if I'm not. Uh, it is directed by uh, I, I, mean, I don't I don't want to mispronounce that. <laughs> but the director, in case you guys didn't know, Corman Corman doesn't like to mispronounce film names. That that's that's not a problem. The mispronounce of film names, but he's he takes very personally. He doesn't uh, want to screw up I people's know, names. People are pretty yeah. touchy about names, yeah. man, and so I don't want to offend anybody and it's because it's never on purpose um but anyways this is he's the director and writer of this film and yeah uh looks good i mean it looks like a political um drama which yeah i'm all for we we have a bunch of them here in america uh i think yep. this, this would be the first one that we would have seen in india i believe right we haven't seen anything have we seen anything about real people like real politicians yeah lagan remember that was a true story <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, yes, uh, well, Rangda Basanti. Rangda Basanti. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are the freedom fighters. We've seen a couple of freedom fighter things, but and well, yes, you mean politicians or real people? Because I mean, uh, have we seen Nawaz play a real person? Rob Rom Two Point was based off of somebody, but he wasn't actually playing him. Correct. No, I don't think so. But Kasari was, and that's not that's not Nawazuddin, but Kasari is a true story. Yeah, but I would real be people. very all interested. those people were real people. I have zero doubt Nawaz can do anything. Um, but it would be very interesting to see him play a real person. Obviously, it'd be more interesting if I knew that person and could tell how good he was. Like when um, uh, Gary Oldman played Churchill. R regardless of your views on Churchill, obviously. Um, but he played Churchill to a team right in terms of his mannerisms and everything. And we as Americans know more about Churchill, obviously. Um, not everything about Churchill. They don't teach us the stuff that you guys know about Churchill here in America. That is correct. Uh, which is an unfortunate thing to not teach. But anyways, uh, that's not the point of this. Um, yeah, but that's I, I'm sure Nawaz can do a, a, just an amazing job of uh, portraying a real oh, person. Sure. Uh, but yeah, that's why I was saying that's why I was saying I would love to see some video of this gentleman speaking and do a comparison of, of that to Nawaz's portrayal. Yeah. And should this be a, the next film of Nawaz's we watch? I'm not saying we're going to watch it next. I know we've done a, a little bit of him, um, but like because I know there's this there's um, the Mountain Man one Mountain uh, Man that people want us to watch that I can't find. If anybody knows where to find that, let me know, please. Uh, and what else? of his is there i feel like i'm forgetting something that uh, like lots of people um have been i don't know because i remember it was ramen Ragam 2.0 which we finally saw this and M manji the mountain man oh there's manto photograph uh i'm thinking uh, looking at all these that i've uh i've seen um recommended to us he was in lion yes he was I never saw. He has Lion. a small role. He has a small role. Oh, Lion's a good film. So It'd be the, much different now. That's the first time that you ever saw Nawaz, and you didn't even know it. And I didn't even realize I was seeing Nawaz and Siddiqui. Yes. 
That's free. I just thought it was some random actor they found to portray that role, and I'd never seen the guy before. Is it Little small, did I know. Is it a small role? Very small role. Yeah, it's not even a supporting role. Gotcha. Anyways. But Lion's a good film. Yeah. Well, let us know about this film, if it's uh, worth a watch, if it should be his next uh, film down below, please. Thank you. Our stupid reactions. Tune in for the